You arrive on scene where a 37-year-old man is complaining of chest pain. He is pale and sweaty. Scene safe, BSI? There's only one patient? Yes. Are there any bystanders? No. My general impression of the patient is poor, so this is going to be a priority patient, and I'm going to call out for ALS for, as an additional resource. Okay. Hi, sir. My name is Mike with Tech Rescue. What's your name? Jason Dingus. Jason, what's bothering you today? My chest really hurts. I have angina, but it's never been this bad before. Did you fall or hurt your neck or anything? No. I'm going to rule out C-spine. Okay. Jason, uh, he's talking to me, so I know that his airway is open. Okay. And he has chest pain, so I'm going to put him on 15 liters of breather. Okay. This time, um, he's also breathing adequately to sustain life, so I'm going to check lung sounds next. Okay. Can you take a deep breath for me? And another. One more. And one more. And another. And another. Good. He's been able to follow all my commands, so I know that he is alert and oriented. Okay. His lung sounds were clear and equal bilaterally. Okay. I'm going to check a pulse real quick. It's strong and regular? It is weak and thready. Do I notice any major bleeds? No. And the patient is pale, cool, and clammy? Yes. All right. Jason, what were you doing when this started? I was taking a nap, and the pain just woke me up. It was a terrible pain in my chest. Does anything make it better or worse? No, it just, it just hurts really bad in my chest. How would you describe your pain? It felt like indigestion, but I don't know. It feels like there's a weight on my chest, and it's making me hard, making it hard to breathe. Does it radiate at all? It was up in my jaw, and, and then came down to my shoulder, but it's mostly in my chest. That's when I called you guys. On a scale of 0 to 10, with 10 being the worst pain in your life, how would you describe it? It's definitely a 10. I mean, this is by far the worst pain I've ever felt. And about how long ago did this start? It started about an hour ago, but it feels like it's been going for days. Do you have any allergies? No, I don't have any allergies. Are you on any medications? I'm on nitroglycerin. Do you have that with you? Yes. Have you taken any of these today? I took one about 15 minutes before you guys got here. Okay. Did that help at all? No, not at all. It normally helps, but this time it didn't. Am I having a heart attack? Do you have any past permanent medical history? I was diagnosed with angina about two years ago. And what was the last thing you ate today? I had a... I think I had a bowl of soup and, and uh, a sandwich about three hours ago. And what were you doing when this started again? I was just taking a nap. The pain just woke me up from it. It was so bad. Okay. Uh, this is a priority patient due to the cardiac related of it. Okay. Um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, do a quick physical exam of the chest. Do I notice anything out of the ordinary? No. Okay. Next, I'm going to take vitals. One twenty six over seventy eight, one forty four over ninety two. I'm going to take his pulse. And respirations. Is 
His pulse is 66 and his respirations are 20. All right. His pulse is 124, his respirations are 24. This time I'm going to check his pupils. Jason, can you look at my shoulder, please? Pupils are pearl. Okay. I'm now going to call medical control to receive orders to give him a dose of his nitroglycerin, sublingual. Okay. And then I'm going to have my assistant give the nitroglycerin to the patient. Okay. We're now going to load the patient into the ambulance and then reassess his vitals. I'm going to have my assistant reassess his vitals. Okay. Jason, are you still with me? Mm -hmm. The patient's able to talk to me, so I know his airway is still open. How's that oxygen helping? It helps. It helps? Good. The patient is still breathing adequately to sustain life. Okay. You're going to reassess lung sounds. Take a deep breath for me. Good. Another. 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 And one more. Patient's lung sounds are clear and equal bilaterally. Okay. I'm going to do another quick physical exam of the patient's chest. I don't notice anything out of the ordinary. No. Patient's pulse is strong and normal. Patient's pulse is weak and ready. Okay. Patient is pale, cool, and clammy still. Yes. Jason, on a scale of one to ten, how would you rate your pain now? It's about a six now. It feels a little better. Does it move around at all? It's still in my jaw and my shoulder a little bit, but it's mostly in my chest still. How would you describe it? It's just a, it's, it's a sharp pain in my chest. At this time, I'm going to consider contacting medical control to give the patient another dose of nitroglycerin, and we're going to continue on with our priority transport of the patient. Okay. And I'm finished. Okay.